welcome back to my channel. Oh. Okay. Much better. Okay. Let's talk about ChatGPT. I know, I know, I know. It's probably all over your YouTube feed, but I am going to tell you how I've been using it to make my life more efficient. And um, this video was actually not made with a ChatGPT script, unlike most YouTube videos. So let me share what I use or how I use it day to day. How I've used it, I'll break it down in three ways I've used it. I've used it for my business, which is a candle and perfume business. I've used it, um, and that was for the website. Um, I was creating a new website for it, wanted to put some fancy text that would draw some eyes, good marketing stuff, because I am not a marketer. <laughs> so that's one way I used it, website. Um, the second way I've used it is to grow this YouTube channel. I wanted to make sure that I'm explaining things in a really concise way. I know you all don't want to watch a video till forever. You want me to get to the point. So I tried to make um, scripts with ChatGPT that were just very concise, gave you a little bit of background into the topic, went into detail about like what to do, and then a conclusion to summarize things up. So it's a really good format. Um, I'm testing it out to see if I like it. So that's the second way I've used ChatGPT. It makes my YouTube scripting so much faster. It literally spits it out in a matter of seconds. And it gives me maybe three or four YouTube scripts within like less than five minutes. Normally that would take much longer. <laughs> so um, the third way I've used it is to do research on trends. Now, it does give a disclaimer that it only knows information previous to like 2021. So it's not like the most recent, recent stuff. And it's not the best research tool depending on what you're trying to research, but um, it kind of gives you a good guideline or sense if you're trying to research on an industry that you're not too familiar with. Like for me, I used it to research like candle trend scents, like I saw some scents like Palo Santo out at like Bath and Body Works and stuff and I wanted to see like if it would like uh, show that in the results, which it did not. <laughs> so take it with a grain of salt, but it can be really helpful instead of having to Google something. When you research something in Google, you have to be very specific to get very good information. And with ChatGPT, it kind of shortens that down and gives you a bit more precise information if you're very vague in your researching, which is kind of nice. So those are the three ways I've used it personally in my daily life. And like I said, for my YouTube channel, it makes scripting so much easier. Um, and then for my website, it has like text that you want to read, you want to click on stuff, you want to shop, like, oh, that sounds like it smells amazing. It gave like really descriptive text for like my perfumes and my candles. And I'm like, oh, oh, that's good. That's really good. <laughs> so, <laughs> and they're accurate too, like, you know. So if, if you have trouble like describing stuff via text, it can be really great to write stuff for you. I wouldn't suggest using it for school though, cause like I said, sometimes the research isn't like very accurate. So be careful y'all in university. So anyways, um, thanks for watching this video. Those are the three ways I use ChatGPT in my real life. And again, this video was not made with a script. This was just <laughs> off the bat. Um, but if you haven't tried it, I'll put a link in my description below. Especially if you have a Gmail account, they make it really easy. It's really free. Play around with AI because it's gonna be around a while and you're probably using it and didn't know that you were using it. How do you use ChatGPT? No? Oh, okay. Um, you say you've never used AI before, right? Um, do you have an iPhone? Oh, do you talk to Siri? You do? AI. Oh, you have an Android. Team Android? Um, have you ever said, hey Google? I got all of y'all smart assistants in your homes to do doot doot. <laughs> okay, sorry. Um, that's AI. <laughs> yeah, any type of 
usually smart assistant type thing um, that has spit out or given you some type of result based on your voice or based on text, that's artificial intelligence. We've been using it for years, but ChatGPT is really famous right now because it can just do more than like a Google search of stuff. So it can do really cool things. Like I said, create scripts, it can give you data, it can uh, solve coding problems for you. That's insane, it can code. So pretty amazing. Anyways, check it out in the description. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'm really trying to grow my channel. If you got any value humor out of this, leave a comment below, I do respond back. And thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.